Good morning, Cyber Traders. How's everybody doing on this lovely Tuesday of June 19th? How's it going on? Good to see you, Grant. All right. Good to see you, George. Craig, good to see you. Don, Tom, Michael. Look at all these great names coming across. James, Gary, Craig, Lita. All right. So, everyone all excited about this morning? What a great morning. You know, I, I want to make a comment um, regarding about this ASTC. Like, um, I, I jumped in early. I'm, I'm right here. Just kind of bringing the, uh, my account manager. Um, I still own it at three, uh, $3 and um, I chased it at $3.68. I'm up about $2,500 um, on that trade. But overall, you could see where it was. Um, I chased it all the way down here uh, when it finally made its pop. But just really quick, want to talk about that stock really quick. Guys, this is what pre-market is all about. You know, this stock right here, the ACTTC, kind of reminds me of the... Um, no screen. Anybody can see the screen? Oh, hold on one second. Let me bring up my screen. Uh, don't know why I had that happened. All right, let it come up. All right, as it's coming up in broadcasting, um, looks like I'm, I'm broadcasting on my, my screen share for the YouTube um, and Twitter and Facebook, but it's coming up right now. But in the meantime, um, regarding about this stock right here, I just want to tell you a little story, which it kind of remind me this morning. Oh, there we go. All right, so let me just bring this back over here so you guys could see it. Uh, yeah, you could see right here, ACTC. Um, I bought it at 368 and I still have the IQ trade at $17, up about 25000 on that trade. Like I told you, that's a swing trade, not more of a day trade. But, um, but anyway, regarding about the ACTC, it's want to kind of like, it, it remind me um, going fishing. Now, I don't know if anyone here has ever gone fishing, uh, but you know, I go to Montauk, I'll do some tuna fishing, I'll go out to the canyons. And you know, it really, really stinks. You wake up early, you start out at 5 a.m. in the morning, and for some of us, we wake up in the morning, and we're like, ah, you know what? And then, you know, it really stinks when you wake up early, and you don't catch anything, you know? But you gotta keep doing it, you gotta keep doing it. And then, you know what? You All of a sudden, it's like, bam, you hit the world's record. You got the nicest fish ever, because it's all about putting in your time. And, you know, this morning, we only had about maybe, you know, maybe a quarter of you that were here before 8.30. And if you look at the chart right here, guys, and if I break this down to a one minute chart, if you got in at, just came in just 15 minutes early, 15 minutes, you could have got in, maybe at a better price than I did, but you know, at $3, but I, I owned it, I chased it at 368. I'm like, there's something's wrong here. But even if you got in at 8.30 and you logged in at 8.30, you got it at 5 and you're probably kicking yourself in the butt. And I told you in the chat room, guys, buy one share of the stock. What do you have to lose? Okay. If you can't buy one share, you'll never buy a thousand. And sure enough, you guys are killing it. You know, killing it. Um, yeah, early, early, I always say uh, early bird gets the money. You know, we always say early bird gets the worm. Early bird gets the money in the side group room. So this is what I want to kind of make a comment. Don't worry about this stock. I know you missed it. You know, unfortunately, we haven't had one like this in about a week. <laughs> I thought that was pretty funny. Um, some people never see this, but look at up 200% just in pre-market alone. Now, a lot of you like, what's the news? What's going on? It's, you know, listen, they, security for the airports, they get, you know, whatever. But, th 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 you know, listen, we don't still know how good and great that news is. You know, I've seen stocks that have great new drugs for cancer and stuff like that, and they still don't go anywhere. You know, so listen, it, we're momentum traders. We're not, we're not speculators and, and stuff like that. So anyway, did a great trade on that, and a lot of you guys did well, and uh, that's awesome. Now, let's talk about, uh, there, there are some new stocks that are moving this morning. We will check them out, uh, but I want to talk about yesterday, because yesterday, listen, to continue, it started from yesterday. Let's talk about the GEVO trade. The GEVO trade, holy cow. I mean, like, you can't make this stuff up. This stock went from five dollars all the way up to over twenty. You know, and I gotta give a round of applause, Andrea. You know, listen. You know, I was talking to a couple of you yesterday, and you, and a lot of you already became gold students, like Fausto. Don't I don't care 
what it takes. Just tell me where to sign. I want to be part of this room. I want to, and you and you wonder why we've been in business for 27 years. Where do you find a stock goes from five to 20? Andrea, okay, who who thanks me almost every holiday, every time he sends me great cookies. You know, he made ten dollars on the trade. You know, let's give him a round of applause from ten, and he chased it. He chased it. Okay. So anyway, a lot of people did well on that trade. That was probably the biggest winner who made it. And I know a lot of you guys. I'm like to go. I need to go down the list who did well and whatever. I thought ten dollars is pretty impressive in one day's worth of work. Guys, think about it. You buy a thousand shares of that stock. Okay, at ten dollars, a ten thousand dollar investment. You sell it at 20. You make $10,000, okay, a day. You times that over the course of 52 weeks, you're talking over millions and millions of dollars. So people ask me, like, how much you guys make? You know what? Come and join the room and you'll see. And you know what? We just had another one this morning because I told you this yesterday. If you missed the GBO, early bird gets the money, and sure enough, you got it just like in this one, the a the ASCT. Now, a couple other big win winners that we had yesterday. My God, the IQ. We're killing it. We're killing it in IQ. Um, I told you, I'm not a seller, you know. I still have the swing trade at 1743. I, I mean, I personally think it's gonna be a hundred dollar stock if it's not gonna be a hostile takeover from Netflix. I mean, the stock, look at that chart. We've been trading it all the way down to here. Some of you guys been some of you day trade yesterday, did well. Kathleen actually made a buck on that. Give her a round of applause. So a lot of good stuff going on, man. A lot of good stuff. You know, every day is always a new adventure here at Cybertrain University. All right, so now um, just to kind of remind everybody, how do we do this? How do we learn? Guys, today's a very important day, okay? Today is the new cycle of the Cybertrain University courses, okay? So phase one is going to start today. Um, so all you uh, bronze, silver, gold students, you got to get into that class. Some of you probably know well, what's the class. Listen, what we're in this room, you got to understand something. You, you could have somebody could teach you how to trade, but if you don't know how to speak the language and trade in the trading room, you'll never do it. You know, you'll never understand. You know, um, just because someone shows you something, can read to you, doesn't mean you got to you, know, you got to practice what you preach, and that's what the room is. But to learn, and you're in this room right now. Um, Cause I know we have a lot of trials in here, and they want to, you know, they get they they get the vibe, they get niche, they're telling their their spouses and their friends, hey, you gotta look what's going on Cyber Trade University, look what's going on Fausto, look what's going on with all the great traders in there, and all and all all the instructors, what they're doing. You gotta understand how to play the game, and it all starts by being in class. So I want all you guys, you gotta make sure, and if you're not in the room in the, in the class, call your education advisor, at Cyber Trade University, and they'll explain to you. But make sure you're there. It all starts in class, all right? And not only that, but today at 12 o'clock, we're also doing Traders Talk, where we have open discussion. Make sure you send in your questions, and hopefully be one of the lucky ones so we can answer them. Traders Talk, very, very critical, very important. Make sure you're in that room also, all right? Very, very important. All right, now, what are we trading going into this morning? Well, obviously, we got the A, uh, the ASTC. That's going to make the watch list. Um, by the way, the GEVO, GEVO is obviously second biggest percentage gainer again. That's coming back again. We made a lot of money. Oh, look, it's gapping up again, right back to where it started. <laughs> you thought ACTC might be good news, whatever. Look at the JEVO. You know, same thing, making a nice move. The I the IQ is back on the watch list. You know, listen, everyone's sitting there crying. Oh, what's going on with the news? You know, the market. Uh, President Trump just put $200 million in, in tariffs. What's wrong with this guy? You know what I mean? Guys, listen, this is great. You know what? Whatever goes up, comes down. Let him do what he's doing. It's making great volatility. You know, a lot. Of, you, you could sit there and cry or you could sit there and cheer. At the end of the day, we're here to make money. So, you know what? A lot of stocks took big hits. This, You know what? But when you see a stock like ACTC, doesn't matter. All right, that one, Hoya also is also um, going to make the watch list. Uh, the H A Y um, Y A. Oops, I spelled it wrong. H U Y A, another big winner. You can see that trade side by side with IQ. So those stocks are still on our watch list. All right, there's a couple other ones that are also popping up over here. This one kind of gapped up. I think it's just a buyout right here, up 28%. 
Um, now, you're going to notice there's going to be a lot of ETFs moving this morning, all due to the news. You know, you got the VIX, you got the TVIX, you got all these ETFs are going to be moving. Now, you know we're not a fan of ETFs, but in days like today, this is when ETFs make their moves. So I, need, I don't need to go down the list of what to trade and whatnot. Listen, they're all good, okay? So it's not going to be a huge list. Um, Ken made 70 cents on GEV already. All right, way to start the morning. Give him a round of applause. So anyway, you got a really good list that's going on um, regarding about brand names. So second protocol, if you want to trade a brand name, go right ahead. I don't need to go down the list of all the brand names, your Intels, your Microsofts, your Bank of Americas, you know, all those stocks that go that, oh, they're all moving, okay? Your, your ETFs. So you could trade the market, um, you know, and I, I'll tell you right now, personally, I, the market's still going higher. This is, this, is a, this is just opportunities to buy. Okay, so when you get a nice little correction, it's healthy for the market, scares out all the, you know, the amateurs and sure enough, you know, but, but we're not looking long term right now. We're looking short term. Short term is there's a lot of money to be made. I just want to remind everybody, you know what, if you did miss the S, the ASTC, it doesn't mean you still can't go higher into the open. Okay, and not only that, but most importantly, just make sure you logged in this morning. Now, did I miss anything I did not call out, guys? Anything that I did not put on the list? VIVE. Um, you know what? Volume is pretty good. Volume is pretty good. You know, but it, it's starting to trend down a little bit. I'm not a great fan of that one, but it's it's okay, Seg. By the way, Seg, you just started. Okay, remember, Seg, forget about being in any position. Remember, we spoke yesterday on the phone, okay? And you know, and and, and you know, he's a new he's a new uh, a new trader at Cyber Trade University. Just listen, get into classes, Seg. And don't worry about what's moving. Believe me, we do this every day. And this is not like a one, uh, you know, a one shot deal. Believe me, there's several of them that we trade over the course of the day. So don't worry about it. Uh, GVO is a target at 21. Well, listen, just remember, can't go broke taking profits. All right. But that uh, GVO has been a great, great move for us. But once again, but remember, um, you got to be a level of. I would say you got to be a four trader now with the GEVO. So unless you're level four, stay away from it. All right, which which you, which you are. I mean, you're in the five category here at Cyber Trade University, so it all goes by your risk to reward. All right, guys, listen. Good luck today. We'll see you in class phase one this morning, um, right after the market opens, so you guys can make your money. And then um, look at that. Look at the a. Look at the ASTC still going up, baby. Look at that. Beautiful. I'm up almost three grand already in pre-market. That is beautiful. Love it. Early bird gets the money, guys. Like I told you, we didn't even the market's not even open yet. So you can imagine what that number could probably be when the market opens up. We could probably see another twenty dollar stock, right? Just like just like the GEVO. Who knows? You know. But remember, can't go broke taking profits. And if you didn't get it, what do I always say? Buy one share. Okay. What could happen? If you're worried about losing, you're in the wrong business. Good luck, everyone. Happy trading. Enjoy and uh, see you in class.